Hi, my name is Daniel and today we will show you the functions of the CAP machine 501S. Together with my colleague Thiago, um, we will show you the whole process. Okay, so we have chosen this car. It has uh, about 270,000 kilometers on the clock. Uh, the gearbox oil, chain, uh, oil was not changed for over 120,000 kilometers which now shows in uh, some shifting issues, slow shifting, late shifting, and uh, we will try to solve this with our machine. Um, the first step will be to connect the machine to the gearbox, and that is what we're gonna show you right now. So for this car, this is the adaptation point. I will open it. and uh, simultaneously I will catch some old oil so I can check at the end can check the result at the end Okay, so I catch some oil and now I will uh, take out the correct adapter for this car. In this case it's the A07B. This is how it looks. This I will use to connect the machine with the car. place. Now I will connect the hoses of the machine. In uh, our case it doesn't matter which one we connect on which uh, side because the machine recognizes automatically in and out. Now that the machine is connected to the gearbox through the hoses, the next step will be to inject cleaner into the system. Therefore we will choose the first menu point which is at detergent. We confirm it with enter. We get uh, some basic informations, confirm them. And now you are asked how much cleaner you want to inject. In this case it's 0.5 liters, so I type that in, confirm it, and the cleaner will be injected into the system. Now that the cleaner is injected, the next step is to let the car run, uh, run at about uh, 10 minutes. You can do it longer, but 10 minutes is sufficient. Uh, in those 10 minutes, you want to make sure to shift all the gears if possible. That's why you have to lift the car up so the wheels can spin. And that's what we're going to do right now.
Now the system is flushed with the cleaner, which means that we loosened up all the dirt. Um, and now we want to make sure to exchange the old oil fluid with that dirt for new fluid. Th therefore, we will now uh, start in the next process, which is exchange the fluid. For the process of exchanging the fluid, you choose the second menu point, which is exchange. You confirm it. You have basic information. You confirm those as well. Then you have two choices. One is direct input and one is vehicle selection. In this case, I know the values, so I will choose direct input. This car has a volume of eight liters and normally uh, you always have to uh, flush or exchange with a little bit more. So we will type in 10 liters for now. Before I confirm, you have to make sure that the car is running. So we will <laughs> Now I confirm. And the process will start. The exchange process is finished. Next step, we have to change the oil filter. Oil filter is changed. Next step is we have to check the fluid level in the gearbox. Therefore, we have to reach a certain um, temperature of the oil. On this car, it's uh, 40 to 45 degrees. For that, we will turn on the car and wait a second. fluid level is checked, it's fine. The next step would be to disconnect the machine from the gearbox and then we are done. exchange is finished, the maintenance uh, of the gearbox was successful and uh, the problems the customer had uh, should be gone now.